and 22nd says, I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. I am so grateful. I got nothing but praises tonight. I'm praising God tonight for, for life. I'm praising God for breath. It said, let everything that has breath praise ye the Lord. I am glorifying God for salvation, for a mind and a desire to be just to walk through the doors. <laughs> I am so grateful tonight, saints of God. I don't take this mind lightly. I know where I was at. I know what I was doing. And I know what I'm doing tonight. I glorify God. It's God that worketh in you, both to will and to do of his good pleasure. I magnify God, saints of God. I thank God for the church of God. I thank God for the church of the living God. Amen, the truth, knowing the truth, knowing what is right. Saints of God, we ain't, I, I'm not confused. Amen. I'm not confused. Amen. Amen. We could be going in, in, in this, this place and that place looking, trying to figure out what's right. But God has showed us What's right? Amen. I think I'm not going to say, don't play with this truth. Amen. Don't play with this truth. You won't know if you're going or coming. That's right. It said, for when they receive not the love of the truth, God turned them over. I am so grateful, saints of God. I just magnify God for all that he's doing in my life. Is everything going well? But I can say tonight, it's well with my soul. Amen. It's well with my soul. Amen. I have a mind and a desire to live for God. Amen, Glory! Amen. I have a mind, Brother Tim, Come on. to live for God yes, sir. in this wicked world. I got a mind to do what's right. Amen. Evil thoughts come. But I, I ain't got to keep them. Come on. I ain't got to do what it say do. Amen. Glory! Amen. I remember. I remember being controlled oh, yeah. by wicked thoughts. I remember being controlled by the enemy of this world. And I glorify God. It wasn't just I happened to get free. God set me yes, free. Sir. Yes, sir. If you're bound, the enemy is just not going to let you go. No. But I realized that God took out his big scissors and broke the chain, cut the chains that he had us bound. And I magnify God, saints of God. I magnify God. I'm not taking it for granted. Pray for me that I be faithful and true to God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right, brother. Sister. I want to thank God for my salvation tonight. I want to thank God for showing me myself. You know, he's he's working on me for something greater and I sense that, you know, and and I'm grateful that I I sense that because it takes the sting out of some things when you when you realize that, you know, that comes with when you understand that comes with wisdom and you know, and, and acceptance for things God wants you to do. And so I appreciate that, you know. I have a habit of saying these, you know, off comments like, oh, you look good, or you look nice, or that's so sweet, and God, you know, quickened me, like, do you really believe those things deep down? The only thing that should be coming out of your mouth is what you truly feel, right. you know. And I thank God for, for showing me that, you know, there is... So many things that have been, you know, God has been working on me on, you know, another thing is I was tuning in to somebody online and they were talking about the hierarchy of your home and relates to marriage and how, you know, God is not going to bless something that is out of order. And so, you know, how or why do you expect him to bless 
you know, marriage or whatever when it's out of order, you know, and he was working on me with submission. You know, you are to submit. It shouldn't be Chrissy, my husband, and God. It's got to be God first. Amen. And as I get into the position that God wants me to be in, I'm seeing the dynamic of my home changing. Glory to God. You know, I, and I appreciate God for that. Amen. My husband and I have been together a long time, but we're having conversations I don't think we've ever had about God Come on. and heaven and, you know, the Bible. And so my kids are asking me questions they've never asked me before. Right, right. You know, my one son had asked me <laughs> something about angels the other day and I hope nobody's offended by this, this is, God wasn't offended I don't believe because he knows my heart but I was telling him well God is like Santa like you you don't see him but he's there you know just like and angels are like the you know like the elves going around doing God's work encouraging you and helping you along the way and stuff and I think he got I was trying to put into context his young mind would understand you know, and so, you know, I appreciate that. And I've been, I went on to think about that a little bit more, and I was thinking how, <laughs> just like you don't see Santa, you know, he drinks the milk and he eats some of the cookies and leaves crumbs on a plate. You don't see God, but he is there. You know, he is there. His presence is there. You know, just like Santa has, you know, these long requested lists that people give him. We have requests from God. Instead of laying them under the tree, we putting them on the altar. Our prayer lists are on the altar like the brother was saying the other day. And I appreciate that. That just helped me kind of, I got excited just kind of telling, you know, telling my son about, you know, certain things and stuff. And. You know, I have a list of my own. My husband is on my list. I have siblings and family on that list. You know, it's like, I remember this church, you know, the church being full of the Fars, the Johnsons, you know, the there were so many people here, you know, the Hunts and so many people, so many families that were here, the church was full. And it's like our generation, there's generations that are lost, you know, and the other, the sister the other day was talking about you know, how this heritage, this truth is, is our heritage, and I'm so fortunate, you know, and I'm grateful to be able to pass this on to my kids, you know. I thank God that I know that he is real, and I'm no longer chasing the Santas, the fake things of the world. I know what's, what the truth is, you know, and that's that's comforting to me, you know, that that's that's something that, you know, I know that God is, is helping me. You know, each step, it's like he's giving me guidance, you know, and that can come from God, you know. So I just thank God tonight. Amen. Amen. Yes. I just felt like I needed to give God praises tonight <clears throat> for something very special today <laughs> that happened. Uh, many of the saints know yesterday was my birthday, and I, I want to thank all the saints and everyone who just showered me with, with, with cards and, and calls and texts and all that uh, on Facebook and all that. It was just such a, <clears throat> a overwhelming day because I got calls all day out of the country and all that. But something very special happened today. And I want to share, I'm holding this envelope here. One person who always sends me a birthday greeting is Sister Brown from New York. And I love her very much. And uh, this came today. And <clears throat> so I called her to tell her, you know, I, I received your card and thank you. And she said, you did? You got it? I said, yes, ma'am. I got it today. She said, oh, well, I forgot to put the stamp on it. <laughs> and she said how, um, the sister that lives with her, she was telling her, I forgot to put a stamp on Sister Dorinda's card. And they were discussing how it'll probably come back in about two weeks, and then they'll have to send it again and whatnot. And I said, I got it. I got it today. Mm. Saints, this is the card she sent me. There's no stamp on it. She wow. even asked me, she said, can you check and see? Wondering if somebody maybe put a stamp on it. There's no stamp on here. Wow. And it came. And there's, you know, they got the little markings that it goes through the machine, you know, the little marking down here where it goes through the machine. But there's no stamp. Mm. That is not supposed to happen. Right, right, right. <laughs> but God did that. We were just praising God for his blessings today. Thank the Lord. <laughs> 